Okay, welcome back guys. We are uh, at Ruins of Old Barbara's place. This is part of the main quest. We're supposed to find the dust of restful death for... Uh, whoa, oh, whoa, Gortwog, I think. Yeah, and this is a problem. Uh, if you have missed it, this is how we look now. We are uh, a race vampire after a very, <laughs> very, very long time of getting hit by vampires we finally got it and uh, now is a problem because okay we can't rest because there's enemies nearby but we also can't rest because we're bloodlusted we haven't killed anything so i didn't think about this but this is actually a much larger problem for tristane than it is for uh, most characters because we have such uh, trouble killing anything ourselves. And also the whole kind of resting to get uh, enemies to appear. Set up ambushes. is going to be really difficult. I think we can kill a skeleton. That's low level. But do they... Oh, wow. Yeah, easy. So, are we... Okay, that settled our bloodlust. Uh, <laughs> it kind of the, the least the least immersive creature to kill. If, <laughs> if you are blood blood uh, starved vampire is killing a skeleton, but I guess it, it worked, so we can finally rest. Yeah, we could probably kill uh, zombies as well. Now they hardly do any damage. Um, yeah, it, it's a uh, trick. Oh, no, no. That's not good. Oh, are we... Do we have more health now? No, we don't. But I guess uh, maybe... Feels like this creature do less damage to us now. Also, yeah, if forgot we're a lot stronger and agile yeah our like um, combat skills has gone up uh, tremendously from our vampire attributes so maybe that could uh, even out the whole uh, thing with how hard it's going to be to rest Oh yeah, I'm also looking forward to this. Just levitating around like a boss vampire. You know, don't need uh, to climb anymore or use elevators. Uh, yeah, some kind of special, really cheap levitation uh, spell. It's it's so these are so cheap that it's like uh, attributes. It's actually quite annoying to be levitating when you don't want to anymore, don't need to, because you're so much slower than uh, running. This is a long levitation spell. Yeah, we'll just kill this one. Yeah, it's noticeable how much faster we are as well. Yeah, I think this suits Tristan. This is like uh, this is uh, coming up on the end game, and that he gets this kind of uh, like the the power he sought after for so long. Now he's immortal as well, so he can just spend eternity reading books and gathering uh, information and artifacts. Okay, so now our levitation. Ran out, which is good. So fast. Let's see, uh, our speed is 74. Let's see, do we have... Yeah, water walking. 
Maybe we should look if we have water breathing as well. Yes, we do. That's good. <laughs> Dust of restful death anywhere? Mummy, could that be? Could this be sort of a quest-related thing, maybe? Oh, it's tanky. It's really tanky, but so are we now. Well, and ah, uh, oh, shit. Okay, we're not. Yeah, I. I it's, okay, we could have probably got. Oh wow, we got parchment and uh, dust of restful death. I think so. That was a quest target. Uh, let's read the parchment. See which one it is. Uh, this parchment was used as a wrap for the packet of powder. Some of its message is now Ill illegible. Is that like unreadable? Lady Med, Lady Medora, I assume. Favor, they intend tend to slay him. I am sending mm, Earth to stop them. You must support me. If the Empire finds I have attacked the royal advisors of Wayrest, probably Wayrest, even if they are assassins, my people will never win the same status and respect as the Khajiit Ians. However, with your support, I something a hero of the empire with and win respect for my people Gortwog warlord of the orcs maybe mm. yeah so uh, he's asking for support from Medora Okay, so let's um Okay, I think uh we got this from Gortwog, right? So Oh no, we can't initiate fast travel during the day. I guess we'll head down into the dungeon then and rest. Uh yeah, another thing I thought about like I think it's almost uh, cheating to uh, fast travel if you're bloodlusted. If you're bloodlusted and you can't even rest, it feels like a, almost an exploit to to fast travel, sort of carefully, so you get health back. This uh, cautiously is like resting, so I don't think you should be able to do that if you're bloodlusted. But maybe recklessly is uh, fine. A strange presence overwhelms you, almost as if you're being watched. Proceed with caution. Yeah. Some warm ashes stuff going on. 
It has been too long since you satiated your need to kill as a vampire. You are unable to regain your strength. So that's the message you get when you try to rest when bloodlusted. Okay, let's see what Gorkwog says. No, okay. Are we supposed to go to Medora? Okay, did I misunderstand this? Yeah. I misunderstood. We need to turn this into uh, Medora instead. We got the quest from uh, Gortwog, but he uh, directs us to go to her. She's the one who wanted the dust of restful death. So, yeah. I'll um, set an anchor outside and then we'll go try to talk with Medora, did any? Oh, this is close now. This is like the short... Oh, wow. That's like the shortcut to uh, her place. Uh, but we can also do this one. Oh, no. I think I chose to... I think we need to... Oh, wow. Can we, can we lock this? No! Okay, uh, okay, this is not a good, <laughs> good situation. What to do? Can we just teleport out again? Mark of recall. Okay, look at this. Look at the animation. <laughs> teleport. Okay. So now, what to do? We have no health. And we can't rest because we're a vampire. Can we just travel to... I, I mean... Yeah, we don't even have any healing potions. Okay, so that's, that's a priority. We need healing potions. And also... Should we just... I think Tristane, in his vampiric desperation and madness, would actually start feeding on the innocent. Let's see. What time is it? Hmm. Yeah, it's not a good time for us. We can't loiter, and it's like... Eight hours almost until the uh, people start showing up that we can feed on because we can't kill anything like maybe if a rat showed up or something we could kill it so I guess then maybe just uh, roam around recklessly in the night until it... no okay we missed it a gaunt, pale child hands you a letter, then darts away. Could this be invite to the vampire things? Dear Tristane, for some time we have watched you. In fact, we have watched you since you received the unholy blessing of vampirism. You have had your odd and awkward moments, but we are not displeased with the vampire you have become. Yeah, for sure I have had... Awkward moments. I don't know how to deal with this. Uh, not being able to rest or combined with not being being able to kill anything. Um, the time has come for you to learn of your heritage. The proud lineage of Lirezzi. Yeah, this is interesting. I know you get like different... Uh, you join different vampire faction depending on uh, what region you become a vampire in. And this is the greatest of the vampiric bloodlines. I assume uh, it could be some... Uh, what do you call it? Uh, bit... Uh, biased. <laughs> to, to prove your allegiance, however, we require a sacrifice. There is a haunt nearby where lodges a member of a lesser bloodline. Go to the place called the Ruins of Old Greenton Shack and slay Homuner. The, this foul insult to our race. When the dead, when the deed is completed, come to Coppersley residence in the Hartsmith farmstead and find me. 
I'm instantly recognizable. Look for a hooded woman. Okay, 24 days. Uh, so I need to kill a vampire. Hopefully it's not a ancient. If it's an ancient, I, I'm pretty much screwed. Okay, I guess we can use our battered skull of corruption one last time, maybe. But hopefully it's uh, just a normal uh, vampire. Okay, is there a time constraint to leave this uh, dust of restful death to Medora? No, doesn't seem there is. So now I need to solve this goddamn situation, like I need to kill something, but how? And I also need potions. I, I guess I need to go to... Um, I need to go to an uh, archaeologist guild nearby. And I don't think there's any on this island. Uh, let's see in our uh, little book. We should have that book now. Um, yeah. Archaeologists guild halls. And we'll look... We need to go somewhere close, so we don't uh, spend a lot of time unnecessarily. Um, Nevia. Aldingbury, Cromot, Longford, Ripbrown, Commons. Okay. Tamgate, Vanshire. 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 Okay, Menevia. Charonfort. Okay, Ripbrown, Commons. Should be a uh, archaeologist guild here, so we could buy potions then. Let's see what time it is. Okay, we keep ending up like at the perfectly wrong time. Would like to end up in the towns just before uh, in the early morning, because then we can just wait a little bit and then uh, slay some innocent. I'm thinking like Tristane, is it in Morrowind? Yeah, it is. Like you have this really cool um, quest line when you enter uh, Vivek. There's some uh, serial killer or something. And I'm thinking Tristane could almost become sort of that in his vampiric uh, desperate madness for blood. Okay, we uh, have promoted you to the rank of associate. I don't remember if that's high or... Okay, orcs. No healing potions. Okay, we got purification. Stamina, we, we need that as well. And now we're actually immune to paralyzation, so we don't need free action. We're immune to diseases as well. And maybe poison, I'm not sure. Okay, that's not a good loot pile. Uh, can we make maybe some make potions? Recipes, uh, healing. Yes, we could actually. Uh, mix. Can we do another one? No. Uh, heal true, maybe? Yes! Do we have two unicorn horns now? Yes! Nice! Three? No. I thought we had two, so... That's good, at least. I was also thinking, like... This is interesting. This is super interesting. Uh, we have... I remember this. Like, if... Um, you can add extra spell points when near undead. <laughs> I'm thinking like, does this work when we're undead? I guess then you could use uh, near humanoids when you're a human, so probably not. Hmm. It's also pretty cool, like if you... 
could do this like more spell points during full moon. That's pretty cool for a vampire. Uh, but I don't think we don't have any gold now for these kinds of expensive uh, things anyway. Yeah, we need more potions. We'll go to some other uh, archaeologists then. Uh, Van Shear, yeah, both of these had. I remember that. Okay, let's see what time. Okay, this is actually better. It's one in the night, so if we like train at the archaeologists and then just uh, spend some time. It's gonna be morning, and then we can uh, feed on the innocent. Because that's basically the only thing we can kill. Oh, this looks good. A restore power. Yeah, we'll, we'll uh, also... All of these uh, restore power and restore stamina is gonna be a lot more useful now. When we can't do it. We're gonna be in so many situations where we can't rest and gain uh, mana or stamina by resting. So those potions go up in value tremendously. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I'm thinking like we train for three hours. It's gonna be almost morning. Uh, Deadric. Let's see what time it is. Okay, it's four. It's not as uh, it's not as late as I hoped. I guess we can uh, burglarize a bit, spend some time. This is a dangerous person now. Bloodlusted, desperate vampire Tristane. <laughs> like if it wasn't bad enough before. Okay, so it's, uh, let's see, it's uh, 5.59, I figured you guys didn't need to see another burglary spree. Uh, so, let's see, uh, it should be, uh, can I even go out into the sunlight with this health? Let's see if there's people just outside. Okay, let's cross the line. This is not like uh, I would. Oh shit! <clears throat> yeah, I would like to uh, be more sort of sneaky about it, but there's no way to kill innocent uh, people sort of in a vamp vampire typical way in Daggerfall. So we have to pretend that's it. Now our bloodlust is satiated, we can... Um, oh, Thermaturgy, I guess that's from the levi Levitation. Let's see what time it is. Okay, it's uh, in the sunlight now, so we will take a little bit of damage, but... Anyway, uh, this taking damage from sunlight is such a small problem compared to the whole bloodlust thing and not being able to rest or loiter. And, um, yeah, it, it would be interesting to hear, like, if you guys have played as vampires and what's been your experience. I think it's kind of, uh, from what I've heard, I, I, I don't have an experience uh, playing as a vampire, but I feel like I've heard or read or seen somewhere that it's generally considered pretty hard and ki kind of a hassle to, to play as a vampire in Daggerfall and I can truly understand that let's sell we should have a pretty good stash of valuable stuff actually yeah look at this Ooh, nice let's see what we get uh, not terrible but not mm, absolutely not good either uh, so Yeah, I think I have a teleport on Isle of Balthiera, so we can get there faster. Uh, 
let's just... Uh, we should have more vampiric style clothing as well. A heavier cape. I think uh, Tristane's days of being sort of extravagant is over. And is more misanthropic, <laughs> sort of gray, vampiric, uh, shadows, stalker thing. Oh, okay. I'm thinking of the, what it's called, like fine, the, the heavy, it looks like a really heavy cloak. Anyway, let's rest for a while so we can uh, travel. I don't want to end up in, uh, or I guess it doesn't matter. We have a teleport, so we, we're not gonna fast travel anyway. Mm. Alright, so... Let's teleport. No, okay, we don't... Ah, that was so... St what a big mistake by me. Traveling here. It's like six days to Menevia. Okay, let's kill someone before... Before they disappear. Yeah. It's gonna be... Uh, is going to be reputations all over the Iliac Bay of, of uh, rumors of uh, some kind of monster. Uh, let's see. Okay, so uh, we were going to ruins of Old Greenton Shack. kill this vampire let's let's try it and this is one of these things that I can't fail oh it's nine days can I go I don't want to spend that much time maybe if I go to a uh, port town first because I think I'll save a lot of time doing this uh, Port town, and then go by ship to uh, okay. That was we can go close to it. Uh, yeah, we can go very close to the. Uh, we, let me see. Is it like eight days now? And then by ship, it's uh, four days. Big difference. And then we can. I guess I, I, this is a suitable situation to ride across the wilderness. Okay, enemies. Oh, we pacified a ranger. I'm thinking like... Also, Tristane could feed on these kinds of uh, people because we are um, so good at backstabbing. It's kind of a cool vamp vampire... What, what would you call this? Tristan is becoming something really scary and I'm thinking his tactic would be to satiate his bloodlust by so, sort of charming people or uh, pacifying them and then just uh, backstabbing them. Okay, a small pool of blood. <laughs> I guess we could use that. I, I, we could uh, just drink it. Mm, a fatal to the w victim, be it animal. Yeah, proceed with caution. Found a pool of blood. Some uh, animal or human had been attacked. Maybe, I don't even know if... Uh, yeah, it probably works with all kinds of creatures. Since it worked with a skeleton, it's, it probably works with with everything. Yeah, it's been too long. I can't rest. 